that's right, okay. what I believe in. So yeah, but yeah. Like Interesting. I, said to you, yeah. I just believe in it. Because you mentioned yeah. servant, it's very yeah. good word. As a Muslim, we believe we're servant of God. Yeah. So how do you know this God? Because this, we believe this God has sent us a prophet and messengers to recognize this one true God yeah. who we cannot see in this life. Yeah. Just as you mentioned, we cannot see God. Well, I, so, I can only answer that when I'm not in this life no more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> because we know, so, we know, exactly. we know, we know, yeah. we know by the power of God that nobody can see God and live. Because we yeah. know powerful, we yes. are the creation of God. Yes. Yeah. And we can't even see the sun. You know, the sun is all powerful. Uh, and we can't, and, and yeah. you yes. also know we can't. Right. control people, places and things. We yeah. can only control what goes on inside us. Yeah. Each and individual, we're yes. all different. Everyone's yes, separate, absolutely. Everyone's yeah. different. Yeah, so we believe God is all wise, did not create us to simply wander aimlessly or to any fulfill our basic... Your God, might, your God more than likely different to my God. So my we believe there's only God. one absolute truth. But there's only one God. There's only one God, because but it could be called Allah. It could be called so Jesus we be Christ. It no, be because called. if you say Allah, we believe, Allah is the creator, the most high, yeah. the all knowing. So he is the only absolute eternal. being, yeah, eternal. He, he has no gender because if you say Jesus is God, then we That's why so I get very to, confused when I pick yeah. the Bible up. Yes. The Bible. Human being. Okay. That's why yeah. the simplest way I can tell you how I understand God is yes. the God of my understanding. Yeah. Yes. Doesn't have to matter to you, doesn't yeah. have to matter to you. Yeah. It's the God I understand who yes. looks after me. Absolutely, because everything you mentioned so far I was surprised because it's similar to Islam. Because yeah. it's not if you look it's in Christianity. To a lot of religions, no, if you look God of my no, if you look at it? other different for yeah. example, uh, Jesus, you mentioned Jesus. Uh, Jesus so we, has got loads of different because, names. Jesus, uh, God, of, of, like, yeah. you look in the Bible, yeah. how many names yeah. has Jesus got? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You don't know. No, but if you look at the actual Bible, Jesus mentioned, for example, in John 17, 3, yeah. Jesus says, this is eternal life, that they may know you, the only true God. He used only true God and Jesus Christ who you have sent. So we believe Jesus was sent messenger of yeah. God. He was sent by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. We believe Allah is most wise, all-knowing, all-powerful. He's the creator of the heaven and earth. He created the day and night. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he sent us a prophet he chose among the people, a human yeah. being, that yeah. to convey the message, that to teach us. For example, he sent uh, Abraham, yeah. Noah, Jacob, uh, Joseph, and um, all these, Jesus, all these were, and uh, all prophets. All these were prophets that man communicated yeah, yeah. Uh, through God. Yeah. Yeah, everybody can exactly. say God communicates to me. A lot yeah. of people yeah. say that. I mean, yeah. but then we have to. The more we know, the less we know. So we believe uh, uh, all these prophets, and apart from, we believe uh, Prophet Muhammad is the last messenger yeah. of God. So because therefore, if he is the last messenger, there must be uh, a messengers before him, a prophet. So as I mentioned. Uh, earlier, so our purpose in this life is to recognize God, yeah. to know who God is, to worship Him, the way He deserves to be worshipped. Yeah. So, for example, if I give you a present, uh, would or your mom, if you give your mom a present, would you yeah. give what she likes or what you like? What she likes. What she likes. Yeah. Exactly. So Not we should. What I like, because yeah. then it's for me. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So and then if you, yes, you get, I don't give to receive. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So we believe uh, we don't should worship God the way yeah. the way He likes, not yeah. the way we like. Yeah. Exactly. Because the way we like is subjective. Yeah. The way He likes is objective. So we believe Allah Subhanahu wa Taala. As you mentioned, nobody can see God. We have a chapter in the Quran. What? There's a chapter in the Quran, uh, Surah 112. The surah is called Surah, and uh, about a few sentences. Yeah. Definition of God. A, a definition of God. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Who God is. So if you don't mind me, can I read it to you? Just to understand it in English. Okay. <laughs> uh, it's good chatting to you guys. No, no, I'll, I'll read it. I'll read that to you. English translation we can Hold give on. it to you. I, I haven't read no, no, I haven't can read I anything. Can I give you a copy of the Quran? Can I give you a copy? Uh, you could give me a copy. Yeah, so the Quran mentioned about who this God is. For example, Surah 112. A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitan Rajeem. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Kul huwa Allahu Ahad. He may say God is one. This is the Quran, Allah, my friend, yeah? Yes. Right. Like, Anytime you yeah. want to know anything in life, yeah. you go to the index. Index, what do you want to know about life? You want to know Jesus, you want to know about your life, the purpose of life. We believe this book is from God. Yes. So you have to go to the index, yeah? Anything you want to life, charity, Jesus, Christianity, creation, yes. death, resurrection, the death of the day of judgment, devils, you know, all everything. This. So this everything. is the surah. Yeah. Is... Yeah. I've got a question, yeah. 
Yeah. Like, obviously, I don't know much about Islam, yeah? Right. I'm a Christian, but I'm open-minded to listen to people. Yeah, all oh, right, yeah, okay. But you see, like, do, 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 do Muslims believe yeah. that Jesus is the Son of God? No. Oh, okay. No. Yeah. What, Jesus, Jesus was a prophet. And yeah. even in the Bible, he mentioned certain verses. What people are saying about Jesus Christ is the Son of God, is someone alluding to Jesus Christ. We believe Jesus Christ is, is teaching, we believe his gospel. Yeah. We yeah. believe Jesus had a gospel. We have the, it's called the Injil. But we don't have to preserve the Injil today, right now. Yeah. So what we have right now is people are uh, speculating about Jesus Christ. They have not, the message is not being preserved. But we believe the Quran is being preserved. And it's the last preserved book on the, till the day of judgment. And we believe Moses was given scripture, David was given scripture, Muhammad was given the Quran. And the Quran testifies Jesus and Moses and all these prophets were given a book. And they, they, they're written in there, but they, they have not been preserved. If people say that they have the gospel of Jesus Christ, then we will believe in it, but it's not been really been preserved. So we will say people are write, writing about Jesus Christ. Writing about Jesus Christ, it's not the gospel of Jesus Christ. If you, if you read the Bible, it says that according to Mark, according to Luke, according to certain so-and-so. But it's not the gospel of Jesus. We need the gospel of Jesus, what Jesus was saying, what Jesus was teaching. So this is the surah that I was reading. Can I, can I read it to you in 112? أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل هو الله أحد الله الصمد لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يكن له كفوا أحد God has described himself who he is in this chapter Surah 112 if you, if you read it say he is Allah who is one Allah the eternal refuge he neither begots nor is born nor is there to him any equivalent for example if you put Jesus into this category he cannot be God because Jesus was weak and God is the most powerful. Jesus was asking for help uh, and uh, he, he asked Allah to help him. So, so he cannot God, be God. It is Jesus human form. So for example, is human form or spirit? No, we don't believe. We believe Jesus was sent by God. He was sent by yeah, God because, because, messenger. because yeah, yes, messenger yeah, a messenger, yeah, a messenger he absolutely. He was a Be messenger. That's what you yeah, 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 there's messenger. a messenger because yeah, in, in this God. chapter in the Surah Al Ikhlas, God says He's neither begot nor was He, uh, nobody gave birth to God, and He, yeah, He was not begot nor is He born. Yeah. So if someone give birth, God is God is here yeah. yeah, yeah, exactly. God, God is, is above. God's always God here. is above yeah. the heaven. We choose to bring him into our life. Yeah. So we believe God has sent we, us we prophets. Need to understand yeah, the messages. definition of God. The definition. Yes. Of, once we understand everything, we make clear. Because yes. when we understand the definition of God, who He is, yes. what does He say about Himself, then we have a clear picture. Because everybody who can say, you know, I believe Buddha is God, or I believe statue is God, or monkey is God. Then yeah. they said that these people are not actually understanding definitely what God is. Yeah. So the definition of God he just gave it to you is called Sports Ikhlas. He's absolutely eternal. Yeah, yeah. I've got yeah. a question, right? So we, nobody can adequately define God because how can a, how can a, a, a finite mind yeah. comprehend the eternal, the infinite? Yeah. It's well, like, for example, like if you want to say, yeah, you look at the universe, it's everlasting, yes. it's expanding. Yes. Yeah. 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 So yes. I can sit here and I can study sort of uh, physics, science all my life, but yeah. I'll never be able to describe and describe who God is. is. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Because we, yes. uh, because our our, our perception our of, uh, yes. of, uh, of of understanding is very small. Yes. Yeah. And we believe the Quran enlightens us to understand the universe around us. Scientists today are finding more what we 1400 years ago was no this book was given 1400 Steve years ago Perry. yes and, until, until, yes until today 1400 years ago it's Sorry. been really talking about scientific uh, scientific uh, method a scientific method is being finding out right now so we will say this book is really from god because it's confirming what 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 the scientists are saying today yeah. so everything that we know we know about the universe the quran talks about it See? And every book is, if the book is from God, like say for the Bible or any other scripture, it has to have scientific. It has to have no contradictions. It has to have no, uh, no uh, thingy, what's it called? No uh, mistakes, all this stuff. So when, yes. we, when we look at other scriptures, we will find lots of errors. Yes, so and contradictions. Absolutely. Errors. We and believe Quran is the only book that is preserved because God is challenging mankind to bring something like the chapter, like the Quran. Yeah. There's a surah in the Quran. It's very, it's about three sentences and nobody has ever brought it something yeah. similar to Quran. Yeah. We believe Quran is the world, is the last revelation of God and is the word of God. Mm. So unlike any other scripture, God did send the scriptures so uh, when, when, before when that. we go back but, in time, what was the first book? We first believe, book? no, we believe was it uh, that Quran or was it the Bible? No, no we believe God has sent the scriptures 
uh, to, to Jesus, the Adam, gospel. Adam. And uh, we yeah. believe he sent the prophets like Moses. He gave him a scripture called Torah yeah. and the Psalm yeah. to, to David. Yeah. And we believe Quran is the last message, uh, the last revelation of God yeah. to all mankind. Yeah. Because Jesus was sent in the Lordship of Israel. Yeah. So we believe the prophets were sent to, to every nation to convey the message that God is one. Yeah. So, that would be interesting to read it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, Even yeah, if, you, if you You're check this, if you open this one, you can, yeah, it's very simple. Yeah. We believe if you open it, you will know about the purpose of give, life, give, give who the, God is, who point. Allah is, and so many things. If Put you read, for, for example, the, the first chapter in there. Yeah, the purpose of life. Yeah, what yeah the, the purpose, purpose of life. life. Yeah. You know, everybody says the purpose of life, like you, some people say, yes. I know I believe the way, the way I see it. Some people will say, uh, to, to be good for, to be mankind. Yeah. That is for example, where did we come from? Our purpose. Yeah. Not, Are we here yeah, based I'm, on I'm random nature? To awaken, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. We, we, the whole world is asleep. That's what I Yeah, think. yeah, yeah. yeah. A lot. Spirit yeah. Spirit yeah. We're all checking all these external things. On the minute you grow up, yeah. you get told this is how you have to act. You have to do this. You have to do that. You yeah. have to get the car. You have to get this. Yeah. You have to get the business. Yeah. yeah. Yes. But we're looking at all the outside stuff. But nobody in this world has any clue about the inside stuff. Yeah. You know? yeah. So the only one we believe, yeah. the only one who knows, well, is Allah Subhanahu wa Taala. We are spiritual the creator. Being, and yes. Quran calls us to. Yes. You know when the Prophet is giving the book, he said that we seek him. With Tafsir, with Quran, with Hikmah. He teaches them purify their soul and he teaches them the Quran and Hikmah and knowledge. So, what we, what we have to do, there's an in, in, in being us that we have to awaken us. That's actually sleeping at the moment. And that awakening us is coming from really light, enlightening yourself with the Spirit of God. And that is because there's two components in your, in your body there's a body and the soul. And yeah. the body of the soul, there's two components. One of them has to be aligned with the Creator. Yes. And when you align with the Creator, then you know how to worship your Creator. Exactly. And that's yeah. what the purpose of life is. Yeah. It's a journey. It's a journey. We're here for a journey, you know? Yeah, exactly. And this life is going to be God has, You know, God gave us life to recognize who He is. And He sent us a messengers and prophets to teach us who God is. Yeah. Because yeah. we wouldn't know God if yeah. there is no revelation and there is no prophet. Yeah. So God has sent the uh prophets and to all nations and we believe prophet muhammad is the last messenger of god and we believe this quran we believe all prophets were given uh, miracles for example jesus was given miracles uh, we believe his birth you know his miracle birth we believe he performed miracle by god's permission for example even if you go to the bible jesus says i cannot of my own do nothing in john 5 30 as i hear i judge and my judgment is just for I seek not my own will, but the will of the one who sent me. Yeah. So someone, God Almighty, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, did send uh, Jesus. It's very clear in the Bible. We believe in the Bible also, Jesus prophesies about Prophet Muhammad. Yeah. He says, I have many things to say to you, but you cannot bear them now. For he, the spirit of truth, shall come. He should glorify to all of you. He should glorify the truth to all of you. So when Prophet Muhammad, yeah, come, yeah. when Prophet Muhammad came, what did he do? He, he, he prophesies about you know, so many yeah. things. There's a chapter in the Quran that uh, in Surah 19, it talks about uh, who Jesus is. Jesus says, even if you look in there, in there Jesus says uh, that my God and your God, I'm going to my God and your God. So de Jesus did have a God in yeah. that case. Even if you mention about Jesus, about the Son of God, in the Quran is very clear, God does not have a Son. For example, if you look in chapter 19, 35, Quran it says it is not befitting for Allah to take a son. Yeah. He is perfect and flawless. So God is perfect. He does not give to have a son or God the Father, God the Son, God. It doesn't make sense logically. Mm -hmm. So we believe God is perfect, is more wise, is all knowing all the time. Because if Jesus is God, then how come he did not know the hour? Because if Jesus says, I do not know the hour, nor the son knows the hour, nor the angel in the heaven, except Except God Almighty, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So we believe this life, our purpose of life is to recognize who God is. Yeah. Uh, and how do we recognize who God is? Is to read Quran yeah. and open our yeah, mind. Pray, if you're pray, sincere, pray. Yeah, you. yeah, here and go and read it. Yeah, My yeah, advice man. is and yeah. pray to God to guide you yeah. to straight path. I'm always and, praying to God for guidance, man. That yeah. is the purpose of life. You saw why yes. we're here. You know, you have answers. Why are we here? So maybe this uh, is the chance for you. This, if you yeah. do All pray that, questions. we believe there's yeah. only one God, as yeah. you mentioned. Yeah. If you pray to that God Almighty, yeah. you yeah. will be guided. Yeah? yeah. And if you follow the ways of we, the prophets, like, for example, Prophet Muhammad. Yeah. What do you know about Prophet Muhammad? So we believe Prophet Muhammad is the last messenger to all mankind. He was sent 
just like uh, the previous messengers and prophets with miracles like Moses for example he split the sea yeah, by God's permission Jesus healed the dead by God's permission he, he cured the blinds and uh, we believe Prophet Muhammad's miracles is right now is in here he performed miracles for example we believe Quran is the miracle of God for example we believe for example Prophet Muhammad says there will be a time a Bedouin will build in tall buildings yeah. and they will compete each other. No, do you know where is yeah, the tall yes, building? Yes, yeah, do you yeah, know where is the tall building oh, right now? Do you know where is the tall building? Yeah. Tall building. He says that Bedouin Arab will compete each other in building tall buildings. Yeah, yeah. Do you know where is the tall buildings? Dubai. Yeah, yeah I've been there. Dubai, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, yeah is the tall. So I've Prophet been Muhammad, been yeah, Prophet Muhammad prophesies about tall buildings. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, and we believe he performed miracles. For example, he, he split the moon because people want to see his miracles. Yeah. And he did, by God's permission, he split the moon. We believe Quran, nobody has ever brought something like the Quran. Yeah. Quran is in all the book. He's got miracles. Even nobody is a challenge to whole mankind. We believe Quran is Islam is not a blind belief. He's got so many miracles. Who sent the Quran? Yeah, yeah. read the Quran. Yeah, who, 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 who put the Quran out there? Yes. It must have come from somewhere. Come from yeah, we divine. believe it's the from divine. someone writing it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So, so let me tell you, do you know the Quran? Other things I forgot to mention. If someone wrote the book, if someone came with a with a message or a revelation and he's claiming is from God Almighty and he can neither read Prophet Muhammad was um he cannot read or write yeah. Yeah. so where did he come from yeah. that's the question it was a challenge yeah. to his to everyone yeah. well, so I'll if someone who cannot see, read see, or write yeah. well, you know what he said all right okay seek the truth the truth is more beloved to say you free yeah sir what's your name so Danny nice to meet you I'm I'm Sharif nice to meet you lovely to talk to you and have you have you met nice to meet you what's your name so, thank you. So, nice to meet you. Nice I'll give you the Quran, yeah? You're welcome. Uh, We're here. Uh, yeah. I know they went over. <laughs> All right. Everyone's a book. Yeah, I'll morning. give you the Quran. Yeah, get, get on the Quran for him. So, thank you very much. And uh, read the Quran. If you have anything, you can come back to us. Uh, if you want to learn more, we're here every Saturday. No worries. All right, thank, right. You. Well, thank you. Guys. All right, take care. Have a lovely day.